Hi everyone, Scottish Cowboy here. Welcome back to the Scottish Cowboys Darts channel. Today we're going to be having a little review of a set of Unicorn Striker Darts. These came from the Premier Darts Retro Mystery Box that I got recently. I'm going to review all the darts that I got in it and I'm going to make up little bundles and I'm going to give them away over on my Twitter page. So if you're not following me on Twitter, head over to Twitter, give me a follow and you'll see when I'm putting these up to give them away. I do a football card every week. If you enter the football card, you get put into the free giveaway and every set of darts will be part of a free giveaway for the next three or four weeks. So guys, let's get these opened. I'm struggling to hold these at the moment because they're 40 grams. So we'll get them opened. We'll have a look at the packaging, get them on the board and then do a quick recap. So let's get a wee closer look. box as you can see hasn't got much detail to it at all I've looked on the internet can't really find any information about when these were made the only information you'll get is probably what's on it so on the box on the front you've got the unicorn sign with a little super value bonus pack inside it with some accessories telling you it's your striker tungsten 80% tungsten darts gripper 2 shafts Flights three times metallic and at one times slimline case. Match weighted to one to point one grams, and as you can see, forty grams in weight. So they're not going to be easy to throw. So on the back of the box, nothing really. Just a little warning to tell you about not to leave kids unsupervised with darts. As you see, you open it. The packaging's came on leaps and bounds since then. I'm surprised to see the little. QR code inside it so these are obviously they are an old dart but they've been made recently they're not they must be in the 2000s anyway so take that out you get a nice little touch as your little checkout card that's inside it world champion 3 dart finishes pro 2 dart finishes 3 dart and hand finishes so that's quite handy to have so put that to the side We'll have a look inside this package in a wee minute, put that to the side as well. So, first of all, we'll take the darts out and the flights. Little case, just a normal little retro case. Fold that over. Shut it. And that's your wee case to take your darts to the pub or the club, wherever you play the darts. So, take these out. Oh man, these are heavy. Put one down there. Get a little flight, and this is where I always struggle. See, getting flights in. It's not my forte. Because I'm as blind as a bat. Never do this live. Why is that not going in? Come on. Nope, still kind of get in. There you go. Got it. So as you can see, it is an old-fashioned dart. You've got the very thick barrel. You've got some ring grooves at the front. Smooth tapered nose. It's a slightly bull nose, but I wouldn't say it's a full bull nose. It's got a taper as well. You've got your middle bit with no grip whatsoever. Then ring grips at the back, tapering up to the stem. Just a standard black gripper stem up until the metallic flight. So, oh no, it's the, it's the most basic of basic darts. Grip levels vary 
low, probably two at the front, non-existent in the middle, and two at the back. But these will be a darts that people collect, they'll not be darts that many people will want to actually use. So let's give them a little measure and weigh them and see how we go on them. We'll measure them first because on the box, as it's not a new, there's no information on the box. It's just buy the dart if you like it and it's the weight. So the diameter of this is nine millimeters. Wow. The length of the barrel is 48.75 and the length of the point is, to me this is quite a long point it's 28.55 so that'll be a 30mm point that's in that uh -oh. look inside see the machining nothing's changed with machining just to put more detail on the darts but that's as basic a dart as you'll find but it's super heavy so we'll get the machine over you know on I'll strip the other two darts down we'll get them weighed and then we'll get them over to the board and have a quick throw with them and then I'll rest my arm for about an hour so first dart 40.3 grams bloody Nora second dart 40.34 grams and the third dart, 40. So, they're meant to be match weighted to point 0.1. Well, we've got one at 40. Bang on. One at 40.37. And one at 40.32. So, whoever was matching these, obviously had his day off. So, let's see the full setup weight. And 41.75 so before we go to the throwing section I'm going to go away have seven Weetabix and a bowl of porridge and then I'll come back and have a little throw with these so guys I'll get you at the throwing section before I get to the throwing section I've set up the darts with the premier darts flights and stems so as not to damage the supplied flights and stems while I'm throwing them I'm going to show you a comparison here. This is the 40 gram. That. This is a Unicorn Gary Anderson 180 dart. Just look at the difference in the size of the barrel. And if you want to go to the other extreme. Stephen Bunton. The bullet dart. Now if you look at the three darts. Put the bunting that is something difference 12 grams 25 grams 40 grams also before we go to the throne I'll show you this little packet this reminds me being a child when when I used to get darts as a child they used to either come from the catalogue or your dad would just bring them in and they used to always come with this and I've not opened this yet, but I bet there's a packet of flights in here that look like a deck of cards. There you go. That is memories in a box. So, in this wee box you get one, one, two, three, two, three, Two sets of flights, some flight protectors, two sets of stems, and spare rings. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine rings. Is that eight? One, two, three, four, five, six, eight. Don't know why you've not got nine, but I'm not going to complain. So there you go, that's your little accessory pack that comes with it as well. As you can see, It's just old style, old style 
plates, little dartboard, they look like number six flights, just regular medium stems, and flight protectors and your rings. So these will all be included in the pack for the giveaway. got the unicorn darts in my hand and as you'll see as I'm about to throw I'm not using the supplied stems or flights because I'm going to be giving them away and I don't want to damage them break a stem because they're old people may want to collect these the flights and the stems will be kept in the box nice and pristine condition so whoever wins it can either collect them or Oh my god, as you can see, these are not easy to throw, you can tell by the angle they're going to go down, I'm going to push them through the air, wow, if there's any professionals out there that use 40 gram darts, I have no idea how they throw them. Getting them to the board's an effort. And at the point down the way, I'm surprised they stay in the board. I can safely say 40 grams is not for me. I like 26 grams, but 40 grams just a This is like a workout. These might be a good dart to practice with for half an hour before you play your game. Because they'll definitely get your arm. Go on. Oh. Right, I'll have a couple more throws and I'll do a little recap on them. Oh, wow. My arm is so sore. See if I can get that elusive treble. I'm sweating. Oh, I'm not getting it now. Nice six day finish. Well, that's the Unicorn Striker 40 grams. What a workout that was. There's no way in the world I could throw them. I don't know anybody who could throw them. You might use them for warm-up or just use them as a collector's but at 40 grams. Don't know if you can see it, but I'm sweating. I'm seriously sweating. They're hard to throw. You need to put your full muster in to get them to the board. And then when they get to the board, you don't even know if they're going to stay. And if one falls out, oh, you'll hear it. Would I have went out and bought these? No, definitely not. 40 grams, too much for me. Very basic dart, very old fashioned. It just shows you how far the darts have came. So guys, thanks for watching. It's always a pleasure to see your comments and see what you think of the reviews. So keep hitting the subscribe button. Keep giving me the thumbs up if you like it. Have a great weekend, but most of all, keep enjoying your darting. I'm away for a lie down.